Hey everyone, welcome to a new week. Say hello, Sarah. Hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> we're, uh, we're here just hanging outside of Sarah's preschool, uh, getting ready to go in for the day. And I want to chat with you guys today about something a little bit deeper than usual. Um, talk about your value, your worth, something I've been struggling with a little bit lately. And I think it's something we all struggle with quite a bit. Have you ever felt like uh, you're just not good enough? Like uh, you're not good enough for your spouse or you're not good enough for your boyfriend or girlfriend or you're not good enough for your parents or you're not good enough for your kids or you're not good enough for your teachers. There's nothing you can do that makes you good enough. It seems like you're always questioning whether or not your value is high enough for them. And I, I, was, I was struggling with that earlier um, this week in terms of, am I worth, am I worth enough? Am, am I valued enough? Am I, am I good enough for my job? Like for the things that I do? Am I good enough for my wife? Am I good enough for my family? And, and the crazy answer to all of these questions and the answer you might not expect is no. No, you're not good enough. You're not. You're human. And they're human. Their expectations, what they need, you can't you can't fulfill. And <laughs> you you're just not you're not enough. And that's okay, except for the fact that we put it on ourselves that we need to be enough. And we tell ourselves that we're supposed to be enough and we look for someone uh, whether it's a boyfriend or a girlfriend or a spouse or a teacher or whatever, we look for someone that makes us feel like we're enough. But the truth is, we're not. We're human. We're not enough. But not with Jesus. God gives us this amazing grace and says, I know you're not enough, but you are enough. You're enough for me because I created you. I love you. And... Um, I'm going to overlook your flaws. I'm going to overlook your sin. I'm going to overlook all the crap that's wrong with you. And I love you anyway. And then, and then I'm going to die for you. Just to bring you closer to me. That's pretty incredible. And so uh, as you go through this week and you ever have those doubts and those feelings of, I'm just not sure I'm good enough. I'm not sure I'm enough. The good news, bad news of it is, is you're not. And I don't mean to discourage you, I mean to encourage you that nothing you do will ever be enough. And that doesn't mean stop trying, but rest easy in the fact that it is enough for him as long as you do your best. As long as you put forth your best effort. Because he loves you. And as for the rest of these people out here, he loves them too. So give them a pass. Forgive them when they, uh, when they don't feel like you're enough. All right. I'll talk to you later. Hey everyone. How's it going? <laughs> I am recording this from Lansing in my hotel room because I'm taking a group of students to MSLI. That is, um, a student leadership program, uh, institute, so to speak. Uh, so I've got uh, a freshman and a senior that I'm come, uh, that I'm took here and uh, they're gonna go through the training. And so tonight I just get to relax and hang out in my own hotel room. They're spending the night with host families and it should be pretty awesome. But it's, uh, it's actually Friday night. Um, I know I haven't checked in a lot this week, but um, it should be good. Um, Melissa's at home with the kids by herself. Mm, not great for her, but um, I know she can handle it. And then uh, tomorrow's gonna be a full day of uh, training here and then uh, we'll be heading back but we won't get back till close to 8 o'clock, 8.30 at night. So it's going to be a little rough. But I'm uh, having fun. Um, you know, I just got to gotta keep reminding myself. Got to keep reminding myself. Uh, trust God. And uh, he's, he's got it all covered. He's got everything covered. And uh, it's going to be good. Uh, <laughs> oh, a little bit of drama going on with uh, Youth for Sunday. Um... But I think that's going to turn out okay. I'm trusting. I'm trusting. But anyway, I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Hey, everyone. Happy Saturday. <laughs> I am a little bit tired. It's been a long day. Uh, just halfway through, and well, a little bit more than halfway through my day here in Lansing. 
uh, to youth kind of retreat leadership training. And uh, in a couple more hours, we're going to be heading back home. And I'm excited for that. Uh, it's been a good trip. It's been good training. And, uh, but uh, I'm eager to, to get back home <laughs> to my house and my bed and my family. Oh, I missed my bed. The hotel room was nice last night, but not super comfortable. Anyway, anyway, just wanted to check in, uh, let you know how I'm doing, and uh, wish you well for today. All right, I'll catch you later. Hey everyone, happy Monday. I am on my way to Lansing for a field trip with my son's class, and we are getting ready to go, and it's been a great week. I uh, don't have a lot of time to chat, but I will catch you guys in the next one. Have a good one. God bless.